Space is fake. The universe is a realm. The moon is a spaceship. Reptilians are real. Direct energy weapons are thousands of years old. They are currently destroying the planet. That's why all the earthquakes and tornadoes and hurricanes and forest fires are happening. It's intentional. It's technology. Because we're figuring everything out. Why do you think three or four years ago when everyone was starting to wake up, all of a sudden they locked us down, made us stay in our houses, made us stay six feet apart so that our bioelectric fields wouldn't touch each other so we couldn't pray effectively. And they're like, okay, the great reset. Everyone's going to eat bugs now. Just like in the Talmud. <laughs> they predicted it in the Talmud. They said the Goyim wouldn't eat meat. This is a prison. The beast system. Think about that. What is a system for beasts? For domesticated beasts? That's called a farm. We live on a farm. The whole earth is a beast system. The mark of the beast is 666 carbon. And the mark of the beast on your forehead and your hand isn't just metaphorical about your thoughts and actions. It's also VR and your cell phone. Because they want to put us all in pods and I'll tell you why. Scientists recently discovered that stress emits static electricity off of your body. It literally breaks open the superconductive channels of your bioelectric field. It makes you give off electricity that's yours. That's why all black magic is rooted in chaos to break your concentration and stress you out. That's what an energy vampire is doing. Breaking your superconductor channel and then siphoning off your energy. Well, that's what the matrix is, right? They put you in pods to collect your electricity and guess what else? Your processing power. That brain inside of your skull is way more powerful than any quantum computer they can make in the same size. And they're running out of silicone. They can't produce it fast enough for their blockchain cryptocurrency, which also, folks, is not good. Trust me. So they're going to daisy chain our quantum computer brains into a massive supercomputer. And we're going to emit electricity from the stress they're going to put us in in those VRs. That's why hell is going to feel like a thousand years. It's not actually going to be a thousand years. That's why also you'll wish for death, but it won't come because you'll be in a simulation. They're going to simulate hell to make you stressed out to emit that electricity and then use your brains as processing power to power whatever machines they have. This is the war at the end of time, by the way. The dragon's probably going to be a nanomachine AI robot that literally looks like a dragon. Everyone who got the pop, pop, jab, 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 they're all going in the pods, folks. They're making them electrical. They're making them more efficient for the electricity and the processing power. <laughs> I just told you everything. And what's happening now is they're going to literally reset the earth like they did during Tartaria because we keep remembering. Every time we remember too much, they destroy us. Just like the Tower of Babel. That's what that's all about. The Tower of Babel is about those evil monster aliens that destroyed people who...